This is the most crucial week for Greece. The country had delayed the payment of 7.2 billion euros, facing the danger to be out of any financial support. In the meanwhile, there are voices being raised all over Europe, arguing that Syriza is playing only lips, while other claims that it is more than fair for Greece to demand war indemnity from Germany. Mr. Adonis Georgiadis, a parliamentary representative from New Democracy, discusses with us the whole economic situation of the country, focusing on Syriza's negotiation actions. Reporting from Athens, for Brussels and Actua TV, Haragioka. Do you believe that Syriza is actually negotiating with the European partners? Or do you believe that it's trying to pull Greece out of Euro and accordingly out of the obligations attached with it? Neither two. Mr. Tsipras wants to keep uh, Greece into the Eurozone, but he doesn't know how to achieve that. Uh, he thought that uh, he could go to the European Union and, say, and, and claim a political deal mm -hmm. that would permit him to do some of the things that he had promised the Greek people before the elections. Mm -hmm. Of course, uh, this kind of political deal cannot happen, because if it would happen for one country, then it should happen for all the countries. Uh, so now he has to face the reality, but his political power is not enough to make a conflict with his own voters and with uh, the members of his party that they believe in drachma. My apologies, what do you mean about uh, his political power is not enough? I mean that he doesn't control his party. He has in his party people mm -hmm. as Mrs. Konstantopoulou or, or Mr. Lafazanis mm -hmm. that they want to put uh, Greece into a conflict with the European Union. So he has to decide and he has approximately uh, 15 days, no more, mm -hmm. to decide either he will go with the European and uh, try to make a deal that would be sustainable and this deal would have measures that he would have to vote in the parliament, mm -hmm. either that he would follow his own party and that means that we will have no deal and in, uh, in a few weeks uh, Greece will be uh, defaulting into the Eurozone. Mm -hmm. The International Monetary Fund confirmed that Greece is about to pay uh, the, the, the upcoming amount. Uh, in, the, in, in the same time, uh, the Prime Minister, Mr. Tsipras, is uh, negotiating with Russia in, in uh, an effort to find that amount. How do you criticize that kind of negotiation? No, he doesn't uh, try to take money from uh, Mr. Putin. Uh, as uh, the official uh, of the Russian Federation said, they had never received uh, any um, request from the Greek uh, government in order to take a loan from Russia. And this couldn't happen because, uh, as you may know, Russia doesn't have the money to give us. Mm -hmm. uh, Russia now is almost a bankrupt country mm -hmm. and they have their own big economical problems uh, due of the conflict in Ukraine and all the measures against uh, the Russian Federation. So um, there are no money for Greece, either in Russia, either in China, either in India, or in, in any other place on the planet except the European Union. And this is something that Mr. Tsipras has to realize it and has to, reali has to realize it as fast as possible. Is New Democracy willing to support the government of Syriza uh, if they have a plan? Do you think we are communists? No ideologically, Syriza but are communists. if you, we have, nothing is communists. To do, we have nothing to do with Syriza. Oh yes, they are. Obviously, ideologically, you are two different, way so two different political support, parties. So we cannot support. We cannot support the Syriza but, government. Yes, but in order to, uh, for the benefit of Greece, if for they the have benefit, a program for the benefit of Greece, Syriza should exit the government today. This is the benefit of Greece, if you ask my my uh, point of view. So even if they have a program, you... you they cannot never have a program. They're totally incapable to have any kind of program. In the meanwhile, the, all those past years, the strict austerity measures had caused a lot of problems in Greek people. We were bankrupt. When you're bankrupt, you have I'm problems. I'm talking about everyday people. And they paid through the, through when, the taxes. When, when you're bankrupt, uh, this is a very bad thing when, it ha when it's happening. Mm -hmm. And in all the bad things, unfortunately, the societies, the weaker people 
are the people that they are most harmed. Yes, the wealthy people there have uh, many that ways That exactly is the factor <laughs> that caused a social crisis. And my question is, do, do you believe that European partners, they do fully understand the deep crisis of Greece, not only the economic crisis, the social crisis that led to a new political frame, and that political frame might reproduce in other European countries. We have problem, but the, the image that someone wants to make Greece show as Rwanda, Burundi, or an uh, African state is not true. You have always to remember that if you want to be better, you have to find a way to produce your own wealth and mm -hmm. live with your own money. How can Greece produce oh, wealth? Oh, Greece can, can, of course it can. Has we all the clever, potential. Well, clever people, we have a beautiful country, we can produce wealth in, in very fast time mm -hmm. if we have the right uh, way of behavior and thinking. Until now, we don't have it. Can you uh, give... The problem is in Greece. It's not in the Germany or in mm -hmm. the European Union mm -hmm. or in the IMF. The problem is here. In Greece. If we don't solve the problem here, even if the European gives us hundreds of billions, they will fix nothing. Mm -hmm. Series of what they are doing, they want to put implement laws in the parliament that will make the competitiveness of the Greek economy to go lower, and then we would need more money. This is not the solution. The solution is to find a way to produce our own money. Exactly. Uh, th this is a very important aspect that you are highlighting. And uh, also, Mr. Schultz, in an interview we had uh, uh, the previous month, he highlighted that also and he talked about growth the problem and the investment is that plan. The problem is that it's, it's totally impossible to make it happen with Syriza and with the government. Syriza. They're communists. They don't know how to produce money. They only know how to spend money. This is the problem. Okay. The Greek people made a mistake. Okay. Mm -hmm. They voted people that they shouldn't be in the government. Mm -hmm. Now, I think that ma many people understand it. They don't say it publicly because it's a little bit difficult for them, but they understand it. Syriza cannot make Greece produce money. They can only spend money. But Greece doesn't have money to spend. So this, this is a big problem. I don't know, it's something like the Gordian Knot of Alexander the Great. I don't know how it will be solved. I'm not very optimistic for our future. How can, in, in your personal perspectives, in your personal ideology, how can Greece produce wealth? We have to make the reforms that would make our economy... Structural reforms? Of course. Yes. Liberal reforms. We have to make our economy to be competitive. We can do it. Greek people are very clever. In the trade, since the ancient times, we were very good. Uh, we, we have a country that everybody wants to come and visit and uh, uh, make tourist uh, industry, shipping industry, agricultural industry very high. We have all the potential to, to have a growth mm -hmm. if, if we change the, f the way we work. But this is structural reforms. And what about the, the consequences you, on people? You, you think that the memorandum is wrong? No. The program is right. This is the reason Greece had uh, increase of our growth last year. We had a record in our tourist industry. We had starting to have growth again. Yes, actually, uh, if I'm correct, it was 2013. 2013 for the first time, 2014 mm -hmm. even, even stronger, and 2015 would be, we would have an excellent year. We destroyed it with the elections. Okay, sometimes democracy has its own faults. It happens. Can also Greece use uh, the, the, the shipping uh uh, part? The shipping industry has uh, its own globally um, economical circle and now it's in the low rate, but the Greek ship owners are very strong. They're still the first in, in the world.